Who's that? Nadia! Yay! Today's video is actually one of the scariest ones I've probably ever done because I am letting my four-year-old daughter pick the color that she wants for her room. So we're gonna be going to the pin store today. I'm gonna have her choose and whatever color she chooses goes to her bedroom. But before we do that, let's hear a little word from our sponsor. Our sponsor for today's video is Mulberry Unlimited. So do you know how when you go shopping online, when you get to the end or check out, a little message pops up and says, would you like to protect your order? Most times we say no. This is where Mulberry Unlimited comes in. Mulberry Unlimited is a monthly subscription of only $9.99 that protects everything you buy online. Your favorite new leather jacket that just ripped accidentally, your laptop fell out of your hands and cracked. I'm telling you, the list goes on and on. You just choose the products you want to add and Mulberry Unlimited will protect you. Claim up to $2,500 each year in product repairs, replacements, or reimbursements. So click the link in my description box to sign up for Mulberry Unlimited and also get your very first month for free by using code MERCY. All right, family, let's get back into the video. Come pick your pink color. We're gonna paint your room, okay? So come here, come pick the color you want. Pick a color, which one you want? <laughs> So that one all right family so here we are at the paint store and i told nadia to choose what color she wanted all right so i cheated a little bit <laughs> i'm not gonna let nadia choose just any color for her room but lucky for me nadia is very girly and she actually likes pink so i did go to the pink section and tell her to choose what shade of pink however one thing I didn't count on is that she could choose one, two, three, or four shades of pink. So Nadia ended up choosing two shades of pink, and she was really, really stuck on them. She couldn't decide on which one she wanted, so we're going to go with two shades of pink. <laughs> we got it! We got it! <laughs> All right, family. So here we are at the house. This is actually what the room looks like. There are three bedrooms up here and Nadia chose this one. Maybe because it had colors in it and it looked more kid-like. However, she didn't like the pink color. I would ask her, do you like this? And she's like, no. Again, Nadia is very, very girly. So she didn't like the color, but she did like the room. All right. So we're going to go ahead and get started with painting the room. Since this is Nadia's room, I want her to participate in the painting of the room, but I don't want her to make a big mess. So what I'm doing is I have a pink brush for her. So what we're going to do here is we're going to paint the room together. I'm hoping and praying that we don't make a big mess, but this is going to be fun. Ooh, so pretty. Pink. Yeah, pretty pink. Put it on the wall. Paint the wall. Wow. I'm not a professional painter, and yes, I could have gotten someone to paint this for me, but I really wanted to do this with my daughter so that she can not only participate, but also to make some great memories with her. But we have to be very careful so we don't get paint all over the place. You'll see here, though, that I'm not prepping anything. I'm not using the painter's tape to tape over things. We're just going to do this the DIY way and we're going to have fun doing it. Okay. So as we started to paint, I did have an idea to write her name out on the wall and she really thought it was going to stay like this. She was super excited. But then when I start to paint over it, she was like, no, mommy, don't cover it. <laughs> but if it was left to Nadia, this room would actually stay like this and we don't have that to do. So <laughs> we're going to go ahead and paint right over it. Okay. All right, family, so the painting is going well. Nadia is still happy about the paint color. And this makes me happy because Nadia changes her mind a lot. The fact that she's still happy about the paint, that's a good thing. That's a win for us, all right? So we continue to paint, paint, paint. So this is going to be the ascent wall. This is the darkest of the two shades of pink that we got. And I'm also going to incorporate some beautiful design after the actual painting is over. I'm going to show you that in the next video probably. But yes, this is going to be the ascent wall. And then the rest of the other walls are going to be light pink.
all right family so as nadia and i started to paint 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 i started to get tired and i started to get overwhelmed because this is a lot i know it's being sped up so it looks like it's very simple but painting is a lot especially if you are doing it with a toddler and also if you're not using a specific i don't know Thing. If you're not like it, I'm not using any tape, so I'm having to be very very careful not to mess up the whole room And I got a little overwhelmed and I ended up calling for backup help <laughs> and that just did the job y'all so Nadia's dad ended up jumping in helping us and we painted the entire room pink we have our ascent wall and we have the rest of the room as a light pink this is turning out so pretty oh my god I was really really scared to really paint this room and I'm actually glad she chose two colors because the first color which I ended up making the accent color was the one she actually wanted and I didn't want to paint the whole room this pink it was going to be overwhelmingly pink and I didn't want that but at least she's gonna have her pink room she's gonna have the darker pink on the ascent wall and the baby pink on the rest of the walls that way we can throw the rest of the furnitures in here without having it look like pink threw up in here <laughs> All right, family, so we are just doing the finishing touches. Again, it looks absolutely amazing. Nadia is still happy. Till now, she's still happy. So we put the last coat on. We're gonna let it dry, and then we're gonna come back in here and decorate the room. And I cannot wait to show you all the bed that Nadia chose. It is so cute, so, so cute. But that's gonna be in the next video. This is what I look like after painting my daughter's room. <laughs> my hair oh my god look at that look at my hands and it's on the rest of my body too look oh my god <laughs> the things we do for our kids oh my god this is the finished product y'all this is what the room looks like i'm happy with this i'm satisfied with this i'm gonna end up painting her closet later i don't think i'm gonna do pink in there and if i do it's gonna be the lightest pink ever you're barely gonna notice there's pink in there <laughs> all right family so we are going to be decorating and accessorizing the rest of the room in the next video make sure to stick around for that there are also going to be some videos popping up on the screen at the end of the video those are going to be very fun and very helpful as well so make sure to click them to watch some of them and also don't forget to check out our sponsors for today's video mulberry this is a subscription that is going to change the way you shop online click the link below use my discount code 
and let them know mercy sent you thank you all again so so much for watching i love you all and i'll see you all in my next one bye